Looking for a beautiful four bedroom South Minneapolis home featuring hardwood floors, finished basement, gorgeous master suite, and so much more? Well, we got you covered. Roll that intro. Hey, this is Michael Getty with Mozzie Properties, and today I'm bringing you a video walkthrough tour of 3817 Lindale Avenue South here in Minneapolis. This is the four bedroom house behind me. We're gonna go and check it out. Be sure if you enjoy the video, hit that like button and check out the description below where I post links like rent price, availability date, and links to the ad. If you enjoy the video tour, but the house wasn't quite what you're looking for, be sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel where I post hundreds of other rental tours throughout the year. Now, without further ado, let's get the show on the road. So, here is the home. Nice, cute South Minneapolis home. And front porch there. Over here, right off of Lindale. Super convenient location. For enjoying Minneapolis and the lakes. And there are uh, plenty of off street parking right here, too, off of Lindale. You got a two car garage off back, but if you got company over, you got some designated spots for that. Nice little front walkway here. Let's head on and check out 3817. All right, so. Current tenants are still in the process of moving and cleaning and everything like that. So bear with us here, but I wanted to show you what the property looks like here. Love this front porch out here. You've got tons of windows that wrap all the way around. Great spot to put chair, couch, got some overhead lighting and ceiling fan. Just come out here, have your morning coffee and enjoy. And then that leads straight into the living room area. So it's this nice L shape. You got your dining room here with built in buffet. And then it extends down this way here, kind of your central living room. And then nice fireplace over here with built in shelving on either side. You've got some supplemental windows up top too. Beautiful door too. Right here we have a nice front coat closet. You notice the nice woodwork throughout the home too, even up near the ceiling lines here. Kind of flow over into the dining room. This overhead chandelier. We've got these really cool design ceiling too. Built-in buffet. These side windows right over there. Okay, now this leads directly back into the kitchen. This way leads you over into the hallway. Let's go jump into the kitchen first. So we got our stainless steel fridge, upper cabinets, backsplash, beautiful counters, gas range over here, built-in microwave, and then a huge cabinetry countertop space over here. Dishwasher, nice big kitchen sink. Some really nice kitchen here. Then again, this is the hallway that gets you right back into the dining room. So we have two bedrooms on the main level, one downstairs, and then your master suite up. We'll look at the two lower level bedrooms here first. Good size room. Overhead light fixture. Walk-in closet. Obviously we got the hardwood floors in here. Nice linen closet right here too. Here's the bathroom. Tub shower. Sink. And toilet. The main level bathroom is pretty straightforward. The other ones are 
beautiful. We'll take a look at that here shortly. Back bedroom here has windows off two of the walls. I've seen this one be used commonly as an office space too. Work well for that. And here's your closet. A little bit of extra stairs space over here. All right, so let's go upstairs first. This is probably my favorite level of the home. The upstairs is just beautiful. Nice big windows here too, looking off to the back of the home. There's your garage right there. And then the upstairs is basically just one huge master suite. So we're gonna go all the way down to the end first and we kind of work our way back. We've got the bedroom down here. And these right here are skylights here you can open up to and have tons of natural light come in. Really love that. Got nice built-in shelving over here. Unique vaulted roof lines. Really nice master suite. Big windows looking off to the front of the home. And then we have tons of closet space. So here's the first huge closet. And one thing that I've seen too is you know, if it pertains right for your current situation, using this as kind of like a nursery right off of the uh, bedroom is a pretty nice setup if that's something that calls to you. Because in addition to this closet, we have another closet over here, and then another big walk-in closet over here. So if you have lots of clothing, shoes, just storage space that you need, collectibles, memorabilia, you're set. Beautiful, tons of closet, storage. And then over here, so here's some of those skylights. Really nice, and then this bathroom up here is just gorgeous. Dual vanity, big mirrors, beautiful stand-up shower, dual heads. One on each side there. You can see the entire bathroom is pretty much wrapped with nice tile. Got tons of storage here. You have floors. And here's your toilet. So that is the upstairs level. All right, coming back this way. Let's go check out the downstairs. And it's just moved, so. Still have a couple things down here, but. Got this beautiful lower downstairs level with lighting that aligns both of the walls here. Fireplace down here too. See, nice fireplace. You got your built-ins on either side. And then extends all the way down. Huge lower level for your needs. You got a bath, a bedroom, bathroom, and then laundry room slash storage. And this right here is a little under stairs storage here with your breaker. Let's go check out the bedroom here first. Here's your lower level bedroom. Overhead light fixture. Work below as a guest room. Here's your egress window. And then here's our lower bathroom. So again, a really nice bathroom here. Stand-up shower, toilet, sink vanity, nice tile floors, linen closet right over here. Also have our laundry room. So we got your washer and dryer, sink basin, and you have additional storage here, and more storage back here. And then this is your mechanical room. 
water heater, boiler system. And that is the downstairs. Last thing worth showing is the backyard and the garage. We'll go show that here. So off back. Nice big deck out here. And it is a fully fenced in backyard too. So you got a little gate. There's your central AC unit. A little gate here to get out to the front. Garage right here, obviously. Here's kind of the rest of the yard. For South Minneapolis, it's nice. You got a nice little fenced in backyard. Not a ton to upkeep, so pretty simple there. Then we have our two stall garage. And as you'll see, it's got rafter space up above here, too. Even a window off back for a little bit of lighting. Keep the garage looking nice. All right, well that concludes service property. If you have any questions, be sure to let me know. Otherwise, thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Bye now. Thanks for watching our video tour. If you're interested in applying for the property, check out the video up here to see how to do our online rental application process. If it wasn't quite what you were looking for, you can browse our other active listings over here as well to see what else we have on the market. Otherwise, be sure to hit that subscribe button to be notified with any new content. Thanks so much and have a great day.